Well, good afternoon. This is our briefing for April 7th, uh, 2020. And with me this morning is Commissioner Josh Slotnick from Missoula County and Missoula Mayor John Engen. Commissioner, you've got some news. I do. Thanks, Mayor. So, like a lot of folks out there, I find myself missing people that I see somewhat regularly but don't know all that well. I'm talking about uh, baristas, servers, uh, John who cuts my hair. Well, there's still a way you can be in contact with these folks and help them out. It's through an organization called MontanaTipJar.org. You can go to MontanaTipJar.org and find the person you used to tip and get them a little money uh, because they're not getting much otherwise. So do that if you can. That's cool. Thank you, uh, Commissioner. Uh, so our uh, Missoula County uh testing site is up and running at the missoula county fairgrounds um and a few instructions with that folks just don't drive out there as we suggested yesterday um you need a referral and a, an appointment but once you're there um you get taken care of in your vehicle and it's painless and quick um and pretty efficient and we hope to be able to do more testing as more testing comes available i want to thank our friends at uh at Community Hospital um, and Providence and Partnership Health Center and the Western Montana Clinic for getting those um, test kits together for us. They donated those so that we could take a little pressure off of uh, existing clinics. So if you want to take advantage of that service, um, you are feeling ill, please call 258-INFO, 258-INFO, um, and you'll be connected with a nurse who can talk you through the screening process and if you are symptomatic uh, and that nurse uh, decides that you need a test, um, they'll get an appointment scheduled for you and you can drive out to the fairgrounds and get that business done. Um, we're at the start of this and we hope, uh, we hope to ramp up as testing becomes available. Josh. Yeah, thanks. It's a great thing. Our, our, our partners basically moved heaven and earth to get that thing going. So uh, some news about Mountain Lion. Mountain Lion has altered their schedules a bit to take advantage of the new changes. Some of these things meaning mean uh, expanded routes, especially on Route 2 that are happening more often. So Mountain Lion can accommodate the need for more space on the bus. They also want to let people know that if you're riding the bus, you should cover your face. And this is really important. A lot of people want to know what, you, what they can do right now to help. This is what you can do to help. If you're going into public, cover your face. This isn't about you. This is about other people. People who, who, this is saving other folks from getting what you may, may have, even though you don't know it. So ride the bus, just do it right. Those are great reminders. Uh, and again, folks, um, social distancing is the key here. Uh, you've heard some news over the last couple of days, uh, recommend, recommendations that you wear uh, face masks, whatever you can cobble together. Um, and please follow that advice. If you're in a situation where you can't social distance, um, please wear that protective gear. Um, but it does not take the place of social distancing. So even if you're wearing a mask, don't bunch up. A um, couple of reminders from, uh, from our friends at parks. Um, remember our parks are open even though playgrounds are closed, right? So um, you can use the rest of the park, engage in that social distancing, get out and enjoy some fresh air. Uh, but those playgrounds are closed because we just can't keep them clean for you. And the ability to social distance is, uh, is limited there. Um, and then uh, why not, a reminder, uh, again, um, please only send toilet paper down the toilet. Um, we're, getting, uh, we're getting some other stuff in there um, and that causes a bunch of problems for the system and you don't need to contribute to the expense of repairing uh, our wastewater system, nor do you need the expense of having a plumber come out and try to figure out um, why something really big and not okay for a toilet is in your toilet's pipes. So um, TP only folks, we appreciate that. Commissioner, you got anything else? That's it, thanks everybody. Thank you folks. Uh, I am in my car, I am not driving, just to make you aware at the moment, um, bouncing between appointments. We're trying to get a city council meeting set up for Monday. It's involving some technology. I had to be in council chambers to get that done. 
um, and we're hoping for the best. So hang tough. We're we're adjusting to continue to serve you, and uh, we look forward to talking tomorrow. Absolutely. Thank you.